pad the captain's armband. This is how Malines will set up. And they'll be playing generally a 4 4 2, which is what they like to play. Peter Harrison in the goal, Sergina Frankson, who has been steady at the back for them. Enrique Gordon, the interesting and, and expressive wide player. Uh, Ramoria McPherson, Tyreek Wilson, Sean Dua, a new face. Jeremy Nelson is back from suspension as well. He'll need to find himself staying on the park. Javon Brown, always good in the midfield. Javon Davis, a young addition from McGrath High. Dean Samuels, our player to watch. And of course, Jason Wright, their most potent of goal scorers, Dwight. Yeah, they're playing a 4-4-2 four, 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 formation, but I'm looking uh, to see how Davis transitioned from schoolboy to the Premier League. He was really hot in schoolboy football, scored one of the goals of the season as well. So it's good to see, and, you know, his coach know him well because he's the coach of Magra as well, and these youngsters will look to do well. And the new additions of Dewar and Samuels, we look to see how they really bring some quality to this Malines team that really needs to get away from that drop zone. Yeah, of course, Jermaine Thomas, the head coach at Magra taking the reins here so we'll know Davis very well and he's really desperately trying to find a partner for Jason Wright. Humble Lion, this is how they'll shape up. They'll be playing with a 3-5-2. Briscoe between the sticks for them. Pasco Christy, Christy, Malik Robinson, Andre Scott, Kareem Bryan who scored in that one-all fixture last time out did Kareem Bryan. Andrew Vanzi, the ever-present captain. Look out for him on the dead ball as well. Afiba Chambers, our player to watch. Everett Swaybe, James Thomas and Roshane Sharp who has so much quality there, number seven. Yeah, and they're playing a, a, a 3-5-2 formation. Not surprising for Vassal, Re Vassal Reynolds' team because he likes structure organization. He said that's what he worked on coming into this game. So at times it will look like five at the back. He looked to plug those half spaces. They haven't conceded in over 200 and odd minutes. He looked to continue that, but looked to nick one on the counter. That's the hallmark of, of Vassal Reynolds' team. Yeah, Vassal Reynolds just managing one window in his last five games. Andre Parkinson, the one in charge of this fixture. The full match highlights, Humble Lion with a header over the top. That was a FIBA Chambers. And in this moment, Sergini Frankson, after just eight minutes, adding his first of the season, a brave header at the near post from an Enrique Gordon delivery. And my lines were away. It was a very impressive first half from the German Thomas coached team. And they continue to come forward. Good work there by Enrique Gordon. A strike from Jason Wright, which was wide of the upright. And then this delivery towards the back post. The heads went up. Then the strike from Franks, who was looking for a second, deflected and over the top. It was all my lines in the first half. Javon Bryan towards the back post. Came to Jeremy Nelson, cutting inside. Nelson couldn't get it under the bar. This one was certainly under the bar and inside of the upright. What a free kick from Tyreek Wilson. His first of the season to go with his two assists. And it was 2-0 to Malines after just 41 minutes. Wilson was impressive. A real man of the match performance from the Malines number 20. And then this. Good work from Jason Wright. He had all it all to do, all on his own. Then the help came from Wilson. This was intelligent from the number 20, slipping it inside. And then that tough touch from tough touch from Jeremy Nelson and Jason Wright with his fifth of the season, first of the afternoon and third for Malines, 3 nil, And that was in second minute stoppage time in the first half. They would go into the half with a three goal advantage, the captain scoring the third of them. Then Humber Lion coming to life slowly but surely. Roshane Sharp out to Kareem Bryan, his third of the season, good finish by the Humber Lion number 27. Scored in this fixture on the 5th of November. Scored again today. On the 28th of January. Good finish. 3-1 at that point. That came in the 68th minute. Just seven minutes later. And Humber Lion were up to it again. Look at the work from Roshane Sharp who had two assists, Roshane Sharp. A pitch of a delivery towards the back post. Not the best defending from Enrique Gordon. And not the best goalkeeping work from Peter Harrison, who did command his six-yard area. And Humble Lion made it interesting for the final 20 minutes or so. Anderson is first of the season, 3-2 at that point. But unfortunately for the Lions, 3-2 it would remain. Mm -hmm. 
four shots on target from Alliance from their 11 attempts. They started well, didn't finish the strongest, but got the job done. Three on target from six for Humble Lion. It just took too long for that engine to get going. In out of first gears, 24 fouls between the two. Malines very guilty, very aggressive within the middle of the park. And they picked up majority of the yellow cards as well. They had more corners too. Double the amount of Humble Lion. And they enjoyed majority of the possession at 53%. Malines leading in all categories and especially the important one. 3-2 winners over Humble Lion this season. Excellent work. And Dwight Jeremiah is with our man of the match. None other than their midfielder, Tyreek Wilson. Tariq, really good performance from you today, epitomized by that free kick. Um, how much did you love that goal? Love it a lot, man, 100%, man. Something you practice a lot? You're... No, not really practice, just have it. Have it naturally? Yeah. And one of the things that stood out to us as well was the intelligence shown in the game. That third goal scored by Malines probably would not have been scored had you not made that run to create the overload for Jason Wright. Um, is this a sequence of play that you practice over and over on the training ground? Yeah, sure. Yeah, so what does this three points mean for you and Malines? It means a lot. Take time, come up on the table. To, to get away from the yeah. relegation zone. Yeah. yeah, good performance from you. And as long as you continue to do that, Malines will have a chance to do that. Continue on, on that track. All the best. Yeah, thank you. All right, there you have it. Our man of the match, um, Wilson, really put in a very good performance today.